Well, and it started with me. Um, you know, I was horrendous in the first quarter. Uh, you know, I told the team uh, that was all my it was all my wrong doing. I had four turnovers. I, you know, I wasn't uh, as engaged as I should have been to start the game, and uh, and, it, and it resulted in us not having a good, uh, a very good first quarter at all. Hey, you've talked a lot about Lonzo and the, all the different things that he does. Do you think defensively, him just picking up full court, getting those steals, can that be something that pushes the team? No, absolutely. Um, you know, he's cat quick. Um, his length. Um, his ability to, uh, you know, his, his hands are very, very fast, very quick. So you know, his ability to pick up full court and, and pretty much he doesn't get tired, you know, that allows us to extend our defense as well. Home back-to-backs are, that don't happen that often. I think the last time year was during the, the lockout year. But is that, is that in, in anything stand up particular about it? No, uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, you just said it. They don't happen very often. I haven't been a part of many um, in my career. Um, I, don't even, I can't remember the last time if, if I even had one, to be honest. So. Um, it, it was definitely um, challenging, you know. Get out. We got out of here late last night, and um, you know, less than 24 hours, we had to be back and, and, and get ready to go. So, versus team has been playing extremely well, so um, it's just a, it's another mental challenge for us, and we was able, uh, able to overcome that. What changed for you personally in the second <coughs> quarter? Was it just taking responsibility for how things went? Yeah, you the take first responsibility, and then you relock, you reload, and uh, you hit the reset button. For me, um, you know, I'm. I'm my own biggest critic, um, so I already knew what type of first quarter I had, and it resulted in us playing poor basketball um, in that first quarter. So um, just hit the reset button when I came out of the game, had them two fouls, came out and uh, hit the reset button, and I would be so I already knew I would be much better when I went back in the game. It looked like you guys were in sync a little bit. You had uh, 23, I think, fast break points. What's that saying about the chemistry? Uh, well, that's what we do um, very well. That's one of our strengths. Um, but we we've been defending at a, a very high clip lately, so when we get stops, we're able to get out and run with the athleticism and the speed that we have. What kind of court awareness does it take for Alonso to complete that play where I think you found him and then he caught and it in the air? Javel. And um, he was already ahead of the play. He was already ahead of the play. He's seen uh, Javel shrieking before I even threw him the ball, so um, those are things that you can't teach. Did you see Kuzma do some other things when his shot wasn't falling in the first half and then eventually the shot started falling, but do you, do you like that? Is it something you uh, try to preach? No, I mean he's been doing, uh, you know, he's been doing it as of late. You know, uh, not just uh, worrying about if his shot is falling, being able to make plays. He rebounded tonight. He also made plays um, um, as well. Um, you know, getting people involved, and then um, you know, once the shot started going in the third quarter, we went to him. You know, we continue to go to him. So, um, but you can't allow you know your shot going in or out. Um, or, or making shots to find, you know, making plays on the floor, and, and it didn't do that. Time. You said personally, you didn't think you played up to your standard in the first quarter. Some of those plays didn't go your way against Luka Doncic. Does, does that add anything to that stick under your call? Like no, nah, he actually um, he actually came out of nowhere to get the double block on me. It wasn't even his man, but he covered for a man. So, uh, you know, and I told him, I said, I didn't even see uh, on both <laughs> both attempts. Um, and then he got the charge. I seen him on that one. Um, I made sure I charged into him on that one. I, wanted, uh, I did that on purpose. <laughs> Brian, how, how important is it, six guys scoring double figures, just to have that balance? Uh, I mean, we have uh, the ability to be able to uh, have multiple guys that can put the ball in the basket, but it comes, it comes with our ball movement and the way we play with pace. And uh, that was the result of it tonight. Well, Luke was saying that, Luke was saying that uh, you know, the last couple games without Rondo, guys played a little bit slower than he would like because you want to build up the defensive confidence. Is the defense where you guys want to be, and now you can, it's time to speed up a little more? Uh, well, I mean, it's not, we can't cap ourselves right now. No, uh, you know, we, we don't have the ability to cap ourselves, and I don't think we, we, we should even want that. So, no, our defense is not where we want to be, and our offense is not where we want to be, and that's okay. Um, so, we want to try to continue to get better and better every 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 month, uh, as, as I feel we've done that, um, and uh, see what happens. Brian, I know question. you're always aware of the standings, what other teams are doing. Uh, does, the, does this weird West where it's like 1 through 14 is tight, does that have any impact on early season games and how seriously they need to be taken? I mean, every game is important in the West. I mean, every point, uh, every game is important in this league, period. Um, and you can't, uh, if you have an opportunity to be able to get a win, um, you, you try to, you want to. Um, that's what the, that's the, what this league is all about. So, you know, uh, and it's fun. It's, the, it's competitive when you know that every game matters and it should matter. Um, you know, when you're trying to compete for something, uh, you know, great for the greater thing. So, um, I like the way we've been playing. Um, you know, we let one go with the Orlando game here at home, but. You know, we didn't play so well in Denver. We've been playing some good ball as of the last month or so.